Hey everyone, it's Dr. S here at Lux Surgery. It is a beautiful day in September. More importantly, we have one of our amazing and beautiful patients who's joined us. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> so we are actually about a little bit over a year out from your breast lift and a slight reduction. Is that right? That's correct. Now, one of the things that we were talking about today was your slight concern when you first started this journey because people are telling you well, you're so young and you want to lift and what's that all about and I can't believe are you going to be okay with the scars? What are your thoughts on where you started to where we are today? Sure. I mean, if I knew how I was going to feel post-surgery, I would have done this many, many years ago and I couldn't be happier and it's completely changed my life. Well, we're glad you didn't because then you may not have found me many, many years ago in oh, New yeah. York, so it worked That's out. That's because you're so young. That's right. Exactly. Exactly. Not too young. I say my best one oh, by myself. No, he's not that young. He's very experienced. <laughs> That's right. Um, but as you can see, we have a great time with our patients and you've done so well. I'm glad you trusted in the process because I think one of the things you're saying has been pretty transformative, right? Like what you wear. What I wear, how uh, I feel. Uh, physically and emotionally, it's just, it, it was the best thing I ever did. Honestly, yeah. it really was. Tell me a little bit about that emotional journey. When you say you feel a lot better emotionally, what was kind of going on or what were I you mean, any, any woman knows when you wear certain outfits, anything backless, you know, if you have a larger chest, it's like pretty much the first thing that you think about. So mm -hmm. to not have to think about that anymore, has it's made my life easier. I know that sounds kind of ridiculous, but just, I don't think about things that I used to think about. Yeah. And also like, I feel like I look more like feminine and appropriate. Like it just, I just, I'm so happy. I was worried about, um, if, well, I don't know if this is appropriate, if I was ever going to have any sensation again or be able to breastfeed and like yeah. all of those concerns and you addressed everything before. I think that would be probably the biggest concern that most women have and we kind of touched on that. I mean, I woke up and I could feel everything. Yeah, well, that's really, that was so important, I think, is that which you was know, crazy. Yeah, that all of a sudden they still have the sensation. It's a lot of it's in the technique, making sure that we're careful anatomically with how we treat the tissue. I mean, those are the my responsibilities, right? Is to understand what your concerns are, your needs are, and then of course, hopefully, you know, deliver yeah. an outcome. So I'm so excited. I mean, you've been a great part of our practice. The whole team knows you. Like <laughs> we all talk about like so many different things. We've gotten to like you know know you in, in every capacity. So. I think it's a journey, but it's a journey for you. It's also a journey for us because we grow from every experience. We get the opportunity to touch someone as wonderful as you. And again, you know, the team thinks he was like an honorary member of Lux Surgery. <laughs> so it's been a great year and I'm just so excited for your recovery and everything Thank that's you. happening. Also to the office, it's immaculate. I mean, you could pretty much lick the floor if you wanted to. And <laughs> I think I, I went to a few other doctors before it and it just like, it was just not appealing with the doctor and the environment. And I just think being able to have the surgery here in New York in a very convenient location, just everything about it was comfortable. I wouldn't change anything. Well, that means the world. Nothing. And I'm trusting your judgment of like sizing of like areola. I mean, it was just yeah. so many things that I was just like, I don't know what I'm doing. Well, there's like, so I many just... variables, right? It's like, okay, where the nipple placement, areola size, what's gonna look appropriate for you? Cause you've been living in some ways and that's like, but it's true, and it, I, there's nothing I would change, and I'm internally grateful to you. Well, thank you. It's a pleasure. So, <laughs> great to have you here in the practice, and we'll catch up soon. <laughs>